We are live from Jamaica. It's Bennett on the new 96.5. I'm here with Stasi Virtue from Jamaica Tourist Board. So good to have you on the show. My pleasure. Thanks for having me. Good morning. Thank you for welcoming us. It's always such a, a warm welcome when we come to Jamaica. This is my second time here. And I got to tell you, well, first of all, we flew right into Ocho Rios, which was so nice, the brand new airport there. We were at the resort within like 10, 15 minutes. I was sitting on a pina colada real quick. Life is good. But um, I saw so many of the friends that I made here last year, like the, the first people I saw and they recognized me. I recognized them. We gave each other hugs. Like you just feel like your family here in Jamaica. Absolutely. And that's what makes us the best destination in the Caribbean, because every single person that you interact with, they will make you know that we want you here. We want you to be a part of the Jamaican experience. We want you to be our family and we want you to be able to say, I'm going to come back. This won't be my last trip. So I'm so happy you were able to meet some of your family members from last year. Absolutely. We, we follow each other on Instagram, like uh, Jade, who is the saxophonist here at Sandals Ochi. He was one of the first people I saw when I landed. And I was like, oh my gosh, like a familiar face. Like it's just so, so nice. And that's just one part of why I love Jamaica, right? The people, the food too, the food. We did hibachi last night. That was so good. The thing is, you know, Benny, every Jamaican cooks as if they're cooking for their family. So it doesn't matter if you're staying on a resort or you're going to a restaurant off property. The chef in the kitchen is preparing the food for you just the same as he would for his loved ones in his own home. So that's that thing that makes our yeah. food superior. You could taste the love. I knew it. I was going to ask what was in the food, but it was the love. We have a seasoning called Irie. <laughs> and we just that. dash some Irie into everything that we do. <laughs> that's what that was. Got you. And of course, all the experiences like, um, Oh my gosh, yesterday was like, I was checking things off the bucket list, right? What did you do? So I did snorkeling for the very first time, thanks to Island Roots. And so we went out on the catamaran and the snorkeling, the water is so blue. I'm colorblind. I can tell you that water is blue, my friend. Like it was so gorgeous. And then after we did the snorkeling, I climbed Dunn's River Falls and I'm afraid of heights. And I almost didn't do it. I was like oh, about to back out. I'm like, all right, guys, have fun. But they pushed me along, and I'm so happy I did. Is that not the most beautiful excursion you could possibly do? Like, it's amazing. That is the absolute best thing that you can do on island if you only have one mm. choice. If you can only pick one thing to do when you come to Jamaica, please pick Duns River Waterfalls <laughs> and the park. It is absolutely amazing. Did you know it is all natural? No man-made influence on how the waterfalls cascades down those meters and meters of rock on the I did not coastline. Know that. Absolutely. And it is also very navigable. So you don't have to be afraid of heights or be afraid of the experience. We have very trusted guides. They literally hold your they hand. They did. They did. <laughs> they show you where to put your next step. <laughs> very, very involved, very, very safe. And it is good for families. It's one of my favorite things to do. <laughs> <laughs> and like the guide was uh, also really funny too. And so high energy, like made the whole experience so much fun. We were all laughing while we were getting wet and like climbing up the rocks. Like it was, my wife said it was the best thing she's ever done. And one of, ever. <laughs> one of the things is that that experience wakes you up. And what your wife said, that's the feedback that we get from guests all the time. Yeah. That this is the best thing that I have ever done. When you are from an island where people come there and they've traveled to other places in the world and then they come back to you and say, this experience is the best I've ever had from anywhere else in the world, that's how you know that you are doing tourism right. <laughs> <laughs> not too bad, right? Not a bad day at the office. It's not a, a hard sell. But after Duns River Falls, you can go into the town of Ocho Rios. It's right there and you can have some lunch. You can go ahead and check out the many, many dining options Ocho Rios is also a cruise ship pair. Mm -hmm. And so along that pair on the waterfront, we have many, many local hotspots that you can just tap into. We have Whalers Seafood that is pretty good right there on the coastline. Can you imagine just be in, being in an island paradise, sitting down to lunch, you've just done the Dunsover Waterfalls, and just like the, uh, Bennett's wife, you are reinvigorated, you are feeling wide awake, and then you sit down to a seafood lunch. You're sitting down to a seafood lunch and everything is fresh. Talk about farm to table. That's what you're talking about. Yes. And then right when you're done, you go and you have a reggae party, a nice concert right on the streets of Ocho Rios. 
that sounds like vacation that to sounds me. sounds good. It's like a balance, right? Like you, you earn that meal after doing like the Dunn's River and then like, yeah, you're enjoying this delicious food with a little sprinkle of Irie, right? Just a bit of Irie. A little bit of Irie, a little touch, a little flavor. But listen, it's, it's yeah, everything. We're checking off every box you could. I'm making new boxes and checking them here in Jamaica, you know? So I have another thing for you to do for your third trip, Bennett. And this time I want you to bring as many persons to the island okay. as possible, yes, all right? we can do that. And for everyone listening and you're trying to see, hmm, should I really enter this giveaway? Am I sure I... <laughs> what a question. Am I sure <laughs> yeah. I want to make a vacation? Yeah. Crazy. But just in case you haven't made up your mind, get your answers in now. Because July 14 to 22 we have reggae some fest on island mm. and that's night after night of reggae festivals something that start it started about a 10 let's okay. say it starts at a 10 but then we add more ranges to the scale now and as the week goes on each event eclipses the other event oh my god and we close out the week with two concert nights friday night and saturday night with a long lineup of the best of the best in the reggae music industry it's so much fun to watch, too, the energy, right? Yeah, but we're not going to watch. Bennett, come with me now, Bennett. We're not going to watch. <laughs> we're gonna, we're, gonna we're be coming a to it. Jamaica. Right. Get be immersed in it. Yes. Absolutely. Oh, my gosh. So we need you here, right? We need more people from Philadelphia here in Jamaica. Four days, three nights, all-inclusive. Uh, $800 towards airfare. All you need is a passport, some sunscreen. All you need is a passport. You don't even need your sunscreen. You can get sunscreen on the island, right? There you go. Don't need, you need a package. All you need is a passport. In fact, you can go shopping on the island. You don't even need a suitcase. Just come with your passport. <laughs> Pack light. Exactly. We take cards here. Every currency is accepted here on the island, digital currencies. And we have ATMs that will give you cash in your U.S. currency. Oh, okay. So just, it's just your passport, just your passport and your card. And if you have an all-inclusive vacation from Sandals, mm. hello. Yeah. Do you really even need cash if you've already <laughs> paid for an all-inclusive vacation? True. These are facts. Yeah. Just bring your enthusiasm and a passport. Just bring you. And just like Bennett, you will get to be a part of the Jamaica family. Yes. Just like Bennett and his wife, when you come back for trip number two and number three and number 10 and number 50, <laughs> the family here at all the Sandals Resorts and anywhere else you're staying on the island will welcome you with open arms. Ah, it feels so good. I'm just going to rip up my passport. You're stuck with me. I'm, so, hey, I'm not leaving. That ain't no problem. <laughs> I got my Blue Mountain coffee. I'm a happy camper right here. That's no problem. No problem at all. We welcome you. Stasi, thank you so much for joining the show. My absolute pleasure. Thanks for having me. It's 96.5, Bennett in the morning. Don't steal my job now. You're too good at this. <laughs> well, it, you come here for a bit and I'll go up for there a bit. Go. We can hey, switch. Listen, Philly's always home for you. Without Thanks so a doubt, much. New96.5philly.com slash Jamaica. Win this trip and join us.